Well, greetings and salutations. This is Rob. I hope everyone's having a good morning or a good weekend, good summer, whatever. Yeah, weather in the UK has been good the last couple of days. And I was hoping to go up the allotment today. But I'm at home. You can probably tell. I got up early this morning to go up the allotment especially. So I haven't actually been up there for a couple of weeks. Um, I've got the weeds issue again. But I have a plan to combat them for next year. So I was going to go up today, make a good start, clear the plot a bit. And get it looking half decent. But it keeps raining so... I'm sort of umming and ahhing whether to go up this morning or not. Because I don't want to go up there and end up just sitting in the shed. So there's no point. I might as well sit indoors drinking coffee and um, sorting a few bits out indoors. So, hmm, a bit bamboozled this morning. Uh, um, in other news, you may know that I lost my job early in April. Uh, I started a new job. Um, round about just after the last video. So saying that I've got a family holiday. If I actually put that video up, I'm not sure. So we went on a family holiday. And the week after I started a new job. Two weeks training in the office. And then I'm about to start the third week on shop floor picking. It's um, it's what they call a traineeship. It's a new thing. I'm sure a few of you are au fait with um, apprenticeships. But this is it's a work-based apprenticeship. Instead of a normal apprenticeship where you work for someone and you learn a skill, this is... It's a joint venture between the college, which for us is Northampton College, and um, DHL. So a few of you that know me will know that I have views on DHLs, but hey ho. Uh, basically, that's it. It's a good job, I mean, I'm getting on alright with it. On early starts all this week coming. Because you do one week six till twelve, then the next week you do two till eight. But when I actually start full time, it'll be six till two and two till ten. Then you get a night shift, which do ten till six. But I'm not doing nights. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just going to kill time this morning, and hopefully. Hopefully, can't be allotment this afternoon. I'm bored. Might sort a few bits out indoors. But yeah, I thought I'd put you up a little video anyway. It's not done anything for a little while. So, that's it from me. I hope you have a good morning. Your plans aren't ruined by this horrible weather. It looks nice and bright out there. It's all cloudy and keeps raining every ten blinking minutes. So, yeah. Might do a little project on the car today. And one of the bikes. I might actually record that. Because um, I keep on uh, not build the channel as a general. Have the allotment, bikes cars, bike rides, stop raining and all the rest of it but to be honest when I go down and do the bikes because I get all greasy hands and that I generally don't record it. Um, ages ago I put a video up about my GT Chucker bike project. I bought all the bits for it and what with one thing or another, I just never got the time to sort it. 
because I feel like there's work in spending time with family and doing the allotment so I just didn't have the time to do the bike I attempted to put it all together last week and the bearings is where you get suspension forks that go up through the frame and handlebars are attached to it there's a set of bearings inside I've brought the wrong size bearings but they're like rocking horse poo to get hold of but without being able to put the suspension on I can't put the handlebars on which means I can't get the gears on which means I can't get the brakes on which means basically it's still in kit form in the car <laughs> but I'm stripping a bike today and I'm hoping I can use the bearings out of that bike that I'm stripping to put in the GT chucker just to get it up and going and then eventually get brand new bearings for it so yeah that's about it I'm going to leave you and hope you all have a good day hopefully hopefully you'll get an allotment video at some point today I'm thinking of leaving the allotment for this morning and then go up there this afternoon and see what we can do because like I say I don't see the point of going up now because at the end of the day oh yeah <laughs> at the end of the day there's no point going up there to sit in the rain in the shed So, no. Right, anyway, before I start moaning, bending your ear, I'm going to go out and I shall speak to you all hopefully later. I'll go up this afternoon if I can. Okay, thanks for watching, there'll be more coming soon. Bonjour.